Hey guys, MJ here, back again with some more Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition for you. So if you enjoy today's video, make sure you smash that like for me, subscribe if you are new. But yeah, let's get okay into guys, it. Hey guys, so in today's episode, we are going to help Zaid uh, and do his loyalty mission. So this one has got two ways of doing it. Basically, um, obviously yeah the paragon and then the renegade um the renegade will just be as simple as that it basically yeah yeah you it, it guarantees his loyalty uh but the paragon um yeah this is why probably it would probably be best to leave zaid as your last loyalty mission to do uh because you need a very very high um, Paragon uh, rating to get that option to come up uh, in the conversations in this uh, mission so yeah anyway let's get into it Tapping into Blue Sun's communications. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Squad Bravo, a shuttle landed near your location. Check it out. Here we go. Keep close. Shot in the back and left to rot. That's definitely Vito style. Let's push ahead. The little monkey. <laughs> I think they're called black pie jacks. And... Report to base. Armed intruders incoming at the southern tip. Okay, there we go. Still playing, so reinforcements incoming. We got your backs. Yep. We got company. <sighs> Credits off that video. This is Commander Santiago. If any of you retreat while the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. Vito. Sounds like he hasn't changed. Sounds like he needs to get shot. Glad to see you and I agree. <laughs> I knew he was a sadistic bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his little coup 20 years ago. So yeah, 
we have a past. Twenty years is a long time to hold a grudge. A grudge? Vito turned my men against me. He paid six of them to restrain me while he put a gun to my head and pulled the trigger. For twenty years I've seen that bastard every time I closed my eyes, every time I sighted down on a target, every time I heard a gunshot. Don't you call that a goddamn grudge? Jeez. You survived a gunshot to the head? Yeah. And you survived your ship getting disintegrated. A stubborn enough person can survive just about anything. Rage is a hell of an anesthetic. Why didn't anyone tell me you founded the Blue Suns? Because it's not common knowledge. Vito wiped me out of the records. He ran the books, I led the men. Worked real well for a while. Then Vito decided to start hiring Batarians. Cheaper labor, he said. Goddamn terrorists, I said. We'd better get moving. Yeah, let's go. That's crazy though that he found it for three songs. All squads mass at the gatehouse. Now they know we're here. We're having trouble with this gang like Bring the whole on, game. You son of a bitch. Zaid Masani, you finally tracked me down. Vito. Don't be stupid, Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are. Again. What was that? Gun nearsighted old friend. Burn you, son of a bitch. Oh. You just signed your death warrant, Masani. What the hell are you doing? Opening the gate. Next time you're gonna blow something up, I want to know about it first. Vito was confident. Had a lot of men. Now he's lost the home field advantage. If we keep up the pressure, no way he's getting out of here alive. You don't make a move unless I know about it first. This is my mission. Remember that. I came here to kill Vito Santiago. If you want my help on your mission, you better make damn sure that man dies today. That's what you you want him dead, then he dies. I don't care what else happens, as long as Vito swallows a bullet. Vito's probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now. Vito's wounded. How fast could he be? Vito's smart. We stop to help these people, and he'll use this time to get away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. Okay, so... Stage right, Vito must die. This is probably the part where you need to do this to get a renegade thing. Uh, obviously, like, this is probably not going to help you if you're Paragon, because, like, you need to save people, right, if you're Paragon, but, yeah, I'm going to go with Zaid's work. Let's get moving before Vito gets away. 
Glad you see it my way. No! 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 Fifteen plus renegade points. I'll take you out with me. This will put him down. Sure, as we go around to like pick up stuff, this looks interesting.
cover. That's it. Shoot it down. Okay, that's good. But there's only a four left now. Oh, closing. Here we go. Twenty years ago. Look at you. I did you a favor. Zaid, please. I'm gonna die here, man. Do something. Try, you son of a bitch. Then guys, uh, I get another weapon upgrade. I've actually found now uh, the Firestorm flamethrower gun, um, which is all right, but it's more kind of like a close quarters type gun. You're gonna have to be like right up in in there, uh, and it's not always the best of things to be right in there especially on the high difficulty levels you kind of want to be keeping your distance and stuff so I don't know if that's a decent gun or not really like um, I mean I, I did use it a little bit in that level and it was quite cool to set them on fire but at the same time to get in that close like constantly um, yeah maybe not the greatest gun in the game but yeah it's still quite fun to use um, and then of course we get the outfit and we get another power unlocked and we level up yet again so that keep, keeps us going uh, for the end game. Okay so that was the end of that one guys. Smash the like, subscribe if you are new and I'll see you in the next one.